Hey everybody, how you doing? Well, make sure we're in the camera here all the way. Yeah, we are. Just barely right here's the edge right there. Bam. And check this edge. Oh, just short a little bit. That's good enough, I would say. I suppose I could lift it up a little. <laughs> Bring it up just a tad. Sorry about that, guys. All the wiggling making me dizzy. There we go. Okay. I'm going to do another sink strainer with some more leftovers. Oh, there went the air conditioner. Let me go turn that off. Okay, this was a canvas. What did I do with this one? Man, I can't remember. Hmm, what was I trying to do with this one? I can't remember. Well, it's been sitting there for a while. I just sprayed the back, tighten it back up again. I don't know what I was trying to do with this one. I have no idea. All I know is I am going to cover it with black because it is nasty looking. And I always do my edges first. I'm goofy. <coughs> Just it just makes sure that the edges are getting nice and done, that's all. I don't have to pour too much on the top and I can spread it around. So yeah, I'm just playing tonight. That's pretty much what I'm doing. Just did that last sink strainer came out beautiful. Hope you're all doing real good. This is, uh, let's see, this is Artist Loft Black. Mixed with everything is two parts Floetrol, one part paint, and water as needed to bring it to a warm honey consistency. <laughs> I used to have my big sticks that I get from the paint department. You know those big sticks? They work nice at spreading paint. This works just fine though. Let me wipe this off. And I can just go ahead and just spread it a little. Just so it's not real thick and coming through to the sink strainer, you know, so the sink strainer can flow. So I'm just going to let it tip off on this end here. Boys are all playing Xbox. Oh, school's gonna start pretty soon. August 8th, Tanner, my son, who's 12, will be starting school again. Seventh grade. Already. He's growing so fast. <clears throat> Let me make sure it's in view. 
and we're good. Anytime you see the whiteness on here, that's just the flow trawl you're looking at. That is flow trawl because the light's shining on it good. You probably see my face in there. If it tilted to me, anytime you have black, you can see <laughs> it's like a mirror. There, I just popped the bubbles, that's all. Let me see, there I am. <laughs> my hair, I think it's not that clear. All right, so yeah, I am gonna use. The same colors I did the last one, almost. I'm going to use the aquamarine still. I'm using bronze. I thought this deep peach might look pretty in there. And white. And this aquamarine metallic aquamarine and then I think I'm gonna use pink oh I don't have a whole lot of this pink left hmm yeah I'll use it okay where's my strainer no silicone in here. Shake off the water. <clears throat> Excuse me. Center it. Let me stand up to center it. Okay. do another one that one turned out so pretty I mean it turned out nice just wish you could keep the shape of them you know <laughs> the design and a lot of people probably wonder when you're doing it they're like oh that was so beautiful you know when I lifted up the strainer and well I couldn't the last video my camera stopped on me but, so I'm using my other camera right now. If it's not that clear and it kind of goes in and out, that's probably why. But, yeah, you cannot leave the pattern because it will be too thick on your canvas. And then you will have... Um, cracks. Sorry guys. was not wanting to come out this one hole over here. And if it doesn't, it's no big deal. But Alright, so I'm going to go with black then. Let's see what this one turns out like. go with that peach. I think that'll look pretty with it. Maybe I should do the bronze and then the peach. Keep an eye on it. Make sure it don't float on this side, you know, because if your table's not completely level, That don't matter because that'll spread it. I just think I'm gonna run out of bronze. Yeah. 
Yeah, the whole school, back to school, back to school. Reminds me of that Billy Madison <laughs> movie, back to school, back to school. messing around here. Oh, was that the order I did it in? No. I didn't do it right. Oh well, that's no big deal. I forgot the pink. You know what? Maybe I don't want pink in there. Hmm. Do I? You know what? Let's not do the pink. The peach is pretty. We'll stick with the peach and the bronze. That's it. White and black. So. Looks like we're coming close to this edge here. So what I'm going to do is take my stick, put it under here. Actually take two sticks. That's all good though. to do a little bit at a time, you know, not a whole bunch. That's going to tilt over anyway. Um, I guess I could go like this. I don't want to do that too much because then you're going to, it's okay. We're going to have to stretch it anyway. Unfortunately, we have to because it will once it dries, it'll crack if it's too thick. This is the last round here. Like water. The last one cut out right when I was ready to do this. Ooh, that was pretty too. See, I wish we could keep that. <laughs> Just beautiful. 
well, we can sure check our thickness. It's pretty thick, so I would take about five, ten days to dry. <laughs> I hate to stretch it, but we have to, guys. <laughs> What a bummer. Okay, so go here. I'm gonna have to stretch it a whole bunch because we have our black right here as our negative space. We can leave that there. That's why I put the black too. And as we take off some. That's the way it goes. Well, that's pretty. I'm glad I didn't use that pink. go. Alright. Not bad. I like the other one better though. So, have a lot of gold here, which we can move it over there. Or bronze. <laughs> I probably say things all the time and then you guys are always correcting me in your heads. We're all loud. There. Quite a bit of paint there still. It's pretty though. I think I like this one better. I don't know. But it's beautiful. Lots of fun too. That look like a cat hair in there. I think it is. Yeah, that is a big cat hair. Look at that. All right. So let's see one more here, maybe. And I think that's good. Yeah. Now, we'll take a little of this peach. That's what I think. Drop a little bit in the middle. A little bit more. And we give it a little swirl just to make it look natural. Oh, there went the light. It does that when it gets hot. So I can always stop it and then it'll restart again. So I can edit this. Hang on. Promise I won't lose you this time. Okay. 
Yeah, it gets hot. That's what happens. But anyway, this is pretty. A little bit of the gold or the bronze missing in this one area here, but it's all good. It sure is pretty, though. I like this one, too. I really do. Love both these. So we have some a little bit of negative space on each corner. Okay. But it sure is beautiful, shimmery. Just beautiful. It's very beautiful. See, I like in the middle how it's not just a circle, it's just kind of a little swirlish thing going on in there. Let's see what it looks like this way. Either way, it doesn't matter. I don't know which one I like better. The last one or this one? Probably. I don't know. I can't decide. I like them both. <laughs> it's pretty. I wish we did have a little bit more of that bronze right there. You know, I could put some bronze there. Um... Alright, hope I'm not making this mistake doing this, but <laughs> I always have to have it that way. <laughs> Not that would have made a big difference, but I'm just so picky. Okay. Look better now. I'll fix that in a minute. Just taking up some of the paint, a little thick there. I think it looks better. It's good. Okay, I like it. Happier with that. Just a little bit more on that side. There's another kitty here. Okay, one more time, guys. Sorry. I just had to put some more gold there. Or bronze. Didn't make a whole big of a difference, but it did a little bit. Alright. That's pretty. I like it. I actually really love it. Alright. Oh, that phone's too hot again. Alright, guys, thanks a lot for watching. Alright, I'll, I'll go ahead and do that 16 by 20 with all the purple um, next. Okay? I'll see you later. Bye bye.